Hi drummers, hope you're well. Right, quick one for you here about that drum fill from Stairway to Heaven uh, by Led Zeppelin, of course. John Bonham on drums, of course. At six minutes, 21. Uh, you know the one, man. You know the one. Goes like this. So it goes. So it's basically a whole load of 16th notes with some little bursts in there. In fact, you might you might consider it to be a, a little bit like what's often called a herter. If you've done herter rudiments or herter style of playing, you get you get that phrase that goes. Like that famous drum fill in uh, Queens of the Stone Age, um, uh, no one knows, right? It's that kind of phrase, isn't it? This time, though, we play it between the snare drum, the high tom, or a high tom of some sort, a floor tom, and then a kick. You're gonna go around that phrase four times, right? So, that's the phrase, we do that four times. Uh, and then the last beat, beat four is different, but that covers the first three beats. Now you could count out the 16th notes to place uh, these little, those four moments in the right position. And that would go one E and a two E and a three E and a, and that's okay. One E and a two E and a three E and a. If you like that, I personally find it simpler to just remember that phrase da 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 da, and play it four times, man. So snare drum, a high tom, a low tom. I'm not saying the exact toms I'm hitting here are the same as what John Bonham hit, but some kind of higher tom, some kind of some kind of lower tom. That phrase, right, four times. So depending on where you're at with your drumming, obviously that might flow straight away. You might need to spend some time building that up. I'm playing that as right, left, right, kick. If you're left-handed, you go left, right, left, kick. Uh, but that's the first bit, man, just sitting on that. Coming at it from a very, very basic level, the first three hits, the stick hits, are evenly spaced out, aren't they? And then there's a gap before the bass drum. Yeah, so sit on that for as long as you like. Remember, four times. And then on beat four, we've got a sextuplet. Ba, 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 ba. Six evenly spaced out notes. Now to my ears, this goes. So basically, right, left, kick, right, left, kick. You can change the sticking. It might well be that Bonham came to the snare drum with the left stick, I'm thinking. I'm not sure, but anyway, that's the simplest way of playing it, I reckon, is right, left, kick, right, left, kick. And as you can hear, it's floor tom, and then a higher tom, and then a kick, and then a snare drum, a high tom, kick. That's another little moment you could sit and just work on. You're looking for them to be evenly spaced out. Great little lick in its own right. I've made other videos about right, left kick and kick right, left. And uh, in fact, I've linked to this in the description of video about building up those sort of linear uh, phrases, those simple linear phrases. So let's get into the whole fill now. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go real slow. I'll do one bar groove leading into it. Then I'll do the fill and then I'll keep rolling those two bars round and round and I'll get a little bit quicker as we go along. Here it comes. One and two and nice and slow. Here we go. Getting it? Three and four and two and two and bit quicker. Here we go. And I'll go slower again. Slightly 
slightly faster. Hope that almost a bit of sense. It's an age-old classic, man. And if you jam this song, right, if you're playing with some other musicians and you jam this song, and when it gets to that moment, everyone's expecting it, right? Because it's just, we've all heard it 100,000 times and it's just etched into our souls, isn't it? And you, you, when you, you need to hit that, man, when you get into that moment. It's coming up, everyone's like, everyone's like oh, is he going to do it? Is he going to do it? And if you land it, it just makes a world of difference, doesn't it? It makes a world of difference. Obviously, like with, I'm always saying this, aren't I? with anything that you learn in songs that you look at, grade pieces, any little moment, take it out, be inspired by it. I always think learning it note for note is the first step in a nice process of sitting with it, noodling with it, making some changes, just enjoy it, goof around with it, obviously change how you orchestrate it around the kit, just be inspired by it. In the same way that, it, you know, it appears John Bonham was by the greats that came before him. Gene Krupa and drummers of that sort um, playing these kind of phrases and it seems like he was inspired by listening to that kind of music and tons of other drummers as well and um, he did his own thing let's do the same thing man let's be inspired by this great drumming and then do our own thing with it as well I'm such a big uh, big fan of that so thanks for watching as always I hope hopefully that makes a bit of sense any questions about that or anything else give us a, a shout uh, please like share and subscribe to this channel thanks so much to all the amazing people who have done if you do subscribe and you want to get a notification every time I upload a video which is most days these days uh, please click the little bell icon and as ever thanks to all the amazing people uh, who've supported this channel via my buy me a coffee support page you can do that in two ways uh, you can buy me a coffee which i hugely appreciate or you can become a channel member as a channel member you get a load of great features including a customized personalized practice plan complimentary zoom session uh, members videos ongoing drum support by like email and video response um, you send me your practice videos i'll give you feedback all, all that kind of stuff so if you've appreciated this channel these videos found them useful helpful entertaining in some way and you're in a position position to please consider supporting the channel in that way thanks a million have fun with that phil it's an all-time great and uh, give us a shout if any questions cheers